There are people who say to me occasionally, I have an idea for a program. I could develop it, but only if I make it proprietary. What should I do? And I, they're probably expecting me to try to persuade them that there's some other way that they didn't think of. But I can't do that. I don't know their circumstances. Uh, what I say is, if that's the circumstances you're in, what you should do is nothing, or rather something else. Don't develop the program. We don't need it in such a hurry, and it's no good for society anyway if we have to give up our freedom to use it. So it's too bad you're in those circumstances, but it's better if you do nothing than if you do harm. Developing a proprietary program is harm because you're tempting people to give up their freedom and become users of it. And you're inviting people to betray the rest of their communities by promising not to share it. That's worse than nothing. So well, I don't do nothing. How, I don't see how the difference, I don't see the difference between somebody asking me to open up my farm for their recreational purposes or to have that farm be an open space for their edification rather than for my development and your idea. Can you copy a farm? Well, no. What's the Land issue? can't be copied. It's private property. That's right. And my copy well, of a program be should be my private property, and your copy of a program should be your private property. Mm -hmm. So if you don't want to make a copy and give or sell it to me, you don't have to. But if you do, then I should have the four freedoms with my copy. It's as if I had a farm and you had a farm. Now, with free software, you don't have, you're not required to do anything with your copy. Right? There are these four freedoms, which are things you should be free to do with your copy, if you wish. But you're not required to do any of them. They're not obligations. They're freedoms. And likewise, if I have a copy, I should have the same four freedoms. Right. So if you imagine a farm copy, then <laughs> you will be able to understand the issues. I, I have to say that if, if the, the philosophical baggage you associate with this movement. But part of it, in my consideration, rather, when I started using the Linux kernel and its accoutrements, I, I would never have done that. Fine, you don't I mean, have to. I, you know, it, it's you want maybe you want to subjugate people. No. Well, I don't think it's right to subjugate people. I don't know what you actually do. So I won't say, I don't know for sure that what you're doing is wrong, but you seem to be arguing in favor of doing things that are wrong based on an analogy that makes no sense at all. A program is not much like a farm. You can copy a program with your computer. You can change the source code and recompile it. There are no copiers for farms and no source code either. <laughs> we have some other people who would like to comment. Yeah. They contain non-free software. For instance, uh, you may have heard of Ubuntu. Ubuntu will install some non-free device drivers without even telling you it has done so. And they and it also contains a cat in in the install in the installation software contains a large category of non-free programs you could install if you want. And they recently made an, a, a, some sort of a cooperation deal with another distribution, which is called, which used to be called Windows, which is full of non-free software. And wh what this shows is that when the developers of a distribution decide that it's okay to have non-free software for some practical reasons, they tend to find it convincing to put in more and more. Now, another you may have heard of is Debian. The official Debian you know, slash Linux system is entirely free, but on their site, they also have non-free software you can download. So I, we can't refer people to their site. What's your attitude about software like computer games, which aren't essential, and there are good reasons to keep them close to source? I'm not in Please don't talk about open source and closed source. I'm not in favor of open source, and what I criticize is not closed source. Those terms are used in connection with a viewpoint that disregards the ethical issues. 
that only cites practical convenience as values. I don't agree with it. There are people who have those views and they have a right to their views. But I don't want, I can't respond to you by talking about those terms because if I did, I'd be endorsing those views which I don't agree with. So uh, I criticize proprietary software and that's any proprietary software. I won't install a non-free game. On the other hand, it's true that games often contain things other than software, especially if they're visual. They will contain an engine, which is software, and also some images and music and text, which is sort of fiction and art, not really software. So, I, And I don't believe that all art must be free, because it's not a work that does a job for you. It's a work that you just appreciate, and that ethically, and I don't have time to say why, that's a different speech that takes an hour and a half. But, <laughs> But you can find recordings of such speeches on audio-video.gnu.org. So, uh, if they split it into the engine and the art, I'd say it would be okay to treat the engine as software and the art as art. So you don't believe that like, novels should be adhered to, should adhere to the freedom? No, I don't. However, there's one minimum freedom that people should have for all published works. And that is the freedom to non-commercially redistribute exact copies. So for works that are not knowledge works, that don't do a job, I'd say that uh, it's okay <coughs> to have a compromised copyright system that covers commercial use and the making of modified versions for a certain amount of, a reasonable time, you know, not a century, but and years, perhaps. So that compromised copyright system would work more or less like our present copyright system, but without the draconian, nasty aspect which copyright has recently taken on with people being sued for a million dollars and stuff like that. 